All right, it's um, Steph got range speaking here, or should I say, Steph the snitch? You know, um, for all the real supporters, the real um, the real subscribers, gang gang cockers who you know that's the movement, uh, range gang. How y'all feeling? How y'all doing? Um, there's a, I'm not even finna entertain the beef as much, but I'm just gonna give y'all the real thing of what went down. Y'all know the story. My man, Famous K. Uh, Famous K, mo- one of his, you know, many of his, a variety actually of his most loyalist and down to earth subs, should I say, came to my video talking about, you know, K Gang, whatever, Famous K Gang. Uh, I'm a op ass nigga, I'm a snitch, I'm a bitch ass nigga. Cool, cool, y'all can, y'all can call me all the names all you want. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but I don't know if the fucking rest of this fucking model, whatever it's called, but feel me? It's not like, it's not gonna phase me, you feel me? I'm gonna just tell you the real reason the story to it. So, yes, um, I did. Yes, yes, I did what I had to do. I did tell Famous K's dad. Yes, I'm Famous K's cousin. Yes, I did tell his dad that uh about the video about him hooking up with the transsexual. I'm gonna get down to the reason why you know bottom. Get down to the bottom on why I did snitch is actually for a very good reason. And many of you guys that may be watching this could be Famous K subs. Famous K could send you guys over here again to uh, do y'all dirty work. But um, it's best if I let you guys know and my subs know what's going on right now. There's a little, I don't want to say beef, it's a mini altercation that's going on between me and Famous K. He hasn't been talking to me to, and, you know, he hasn't been talking to me for, it's maybe been 21 hours. It's literally been 21 hours. I keep count. I do all the work and keep count and definitely check up on my cousin like that to uh see when he hasn't talked to me i definitely checked the last text the last text literally said i love you bro don't take it personal and look i just look i'm getting down to the bottom of why i told told on this dude so story is you know you guys know the story of you know famous k hooking up with the transsexual the uh person that he hooked up with he didn't lie she was a very badass bitch and i wanted to get her so bad he showed me many types of videos he sent me snapchat videos this is the this is the side he didn't tell you he sent me snapchat videos of him piping him piping and boning down the girl or should i say it's because we don't know what she is as of right now well he may have classified what she is you know I don't know if she's a Pokemon, she could be a Digimon, who knows. But we, we class, we, I've seen it, I've seen it before. He showed me and sent me the videos of piping her it down, should I say. He showed me the videos. Jealousy came into play, a little bit of jealousy came here and there. And, um, yeah, this is the side he didn't tell you, like I said. Jealousy came into play. I wasn't... I was honestly, um, at this point, I was very childish enough to send a message to his dad saying, you know what, your son, you know, your son does YouTube and whatnot. He put out his business that he hooked up with a tranny, and you need to know this. Uh, he piped the tranny down. So I let his father know that, and his father was very upset with it. You guys know the story about that. His father disowned him. And his father gave me a reward of fifty dollars. I had to do it for the money. Fifty dollars is very it was very necessary for me at this moment because what I was gonna buy with that fifty dollars is I do not know yet. So I'm gonna have to use this fifty dollars on something very valuable. And yeah, the, the story is is that I had to tell his dad because um like I said, jealousy a little bit, child play came into it and um I just wanted my ch- wanted to be involved. Like this is my own cousin we're talking about. This is my own cousin we're talking about that didn't let me bone down the tranny. I was gonna hit her with the the back shots. You feel me? I was it's I was gonna hit it with the back shots. You feel me? He sent me videos to get me jealous. You feel me? He sent me. You see? You should have. You guys may have not wanted to see, but you should have seen his faces in the Snapchat videos that he sent me. He did it to make me mad. He did it to make me jealous, and 
I couldn't get my 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 you know I couldn't get my wah wah and I couldn't get it in. I couldn't go there. He didn't let me know what he was up to that day. And um, yeah, you guys seen the screenshot of our text? It look. I'm um many of you guys may hate me now because I snitched, but it was very, it was for a very necessary reason. If you guys you know support me as well, go over to Famous K his recent video or whatever. Go over to his video. And just say range gang or say gang gang cockatoo because you guys need to know that this was for a reason for the best of all of us you feel me for me for famous K and for you guys as well we're gonna release this side of the story if he tends to keep this going on I just came out broke out saying I did this out of jealousy there was a little child play coming in to begin with as to why I snitched and told his father about this video that he made and about his actions boning down the tranny and I'm sorry to hear that he got this on, but if Famous K keeps this going on, if he keeps this going on forever, keep this altercation, keeps the hatred going on, I will have to drop a diss track. And it only takes 10 likes, you feel me? It only takes 10 likes on this video for me to drop the diss track. And I'm serious about this. I will drop a diss track on Famous K if it's being taken that far by him and his subscribers. Though you guys, Famous K subs, Famous K gang, K gang, whatever you guys are. You guys are the ones that are tempting me, y'all. You guys are testing my patience. Sometimes I can't take it anymore, and I will have to take it to, you know, further situations as to having to diss you guys and this famous K himself. So with that being said, thank you guys for watching. You guys know the story as to why I told his father about, you know, the business he did with this tranny, this it, and we're gonna leave it at that. If he breaks out any more news to you guys, I will definitely watch it and tune into it and definitely, definitely, definitely will identify if it's true or not to you guys. So thank you guys for watching Range Gang, Gang Gang Cockatoo. You always will be, you always will have a place in my heart. Stab Guy Range is out of here, man. I'm signing out. Um, That's all I want to say. Drop a like on this video. 10 likes is all it takes on this video for me to drop the diss track. Just know that. And if I see more comments from you guys. <laughs> By you guys, I mean Famous K Gang. And uh, really, that's about it. Keep subscribing. Uh, we're going to get the subscriber goal up a little bit more. Uh, turn on post notifications by hitting that bell so you know when I upload a video. So that's pretty much it. Being You know, with the story being said and done, I'm out.